Now I'll do the kafta from scratch because uh, you can buy the kafta at the butcher shop. But uh, my daughter's friend, uh, she doesn't have a, a Lebanese butcher. So she asked for a kafta from scratch. From scratch, you need one onion. I'll, uh, I just cut it in big uh, pieces, but then I'll chop it here in the food processor. The parsley, like around one cup, but uh, you have to take off the big uh, stems. It's not like coriander. Coriander, you have to use the whole stem, but in parsley, it's not like that. You add the parsley. You add half a teaspoon of salt and half a teaspoon of black pepper. With kata, it's only uh, it's enough the black pepper, not more than that. You start Then you add um, It's around a half a kilo of uh, minced meat Or it's more than uh, one pound Like one pound uh, maybe and a half I don't know how to say it But it's more than one pound Don't put it so uh, uh, for a long time in the food processor just to get the parsley and the, uh, and the onions. Careful with the blades. While taking off the blades, be careful. Mix it by hand. With kafta, you can do so many dishes, like one of them uh, is called arais. It's a sandwich in pita bread. You just spread the kafta like that. Don't make it very thick because uh, the pita bread is already baked and it will burn if you bake it, uh, if you make it thick, so uh, it won't take more time to, to be cooked, like that. I'll do another one. And then you just bake it in the oven. It's a sandwich. If you are in a hurry for dinner or for lunch, you can take it. Now we can make another uh, way of kafta. Now we have uh, an, an oven proof uh, uh, dish or uh, uh, baking sheet. You spread the kafta. Like that. You add few slices of tomato on top, so it will uh, give it some juice. The baked potatoes, like usual, in a 
in the oven, I bake them. One potato for this uh, dish, it's uh, more than enough. And then uh, this is optional. This is uh, pomegranate uh, sauce. It gives a sourness. With our food, we love the sour taste. So I just maybe uh, one tablespoon of uh, uh, the pomegranate sauce on top. And then I'll bake it. Maybe it will take 10 to 15 minutes on at uh, 350 degrees, not more than that. As a way of uh, serving uh, kafta, you can make it like hamburger and fry it in oil or bake it, it's up to you. Then with the, on the side, you can add the uh, French fries or uh, uh, tomato sauce with the uh, pomegranate uh, sauce. Whatever way you want. If you want, you can even uh, barbecue on the barbecue. You can make it like that. And with a skewer. You can, uh, like uh, for a barbecue. It smells so good on a barbecue. All your uh, your neighbors will will ask you about this smell. I used when when we were living in uh, in our old house, my neighbors would ask me, "What this smell? It's so good." This is our kafta on the barbecue. You just put this over and then you do it on barbecue. Sahtin. This is the arayis. You can eat it with uh, pickles. You can just put it like that, eat it with pickles or with uh, uh, plain uh, yogurt. Add some cucumbers if you like and some dry mint and a pinch of salt. It's not, it goes with the kafta with the barbecue kafta and with the arais. And here's a, a compliment to the kafta, it's uh, the batata kafta. And sahtin.